Okay, Barbara just made me watch Minions, The Rise of Grey. That was the best experience I've ever experienced. Honestly. I, well, I'm a known Minion hater. I don't like the Minions movies. Barbara is the opposite. Um, I love the Minions! Yeah, so it's kind of a tradition now that when I go see a movie with Barbara that I didn't intend to see or that I didn't necessarily want to see. Um, exception, I guess, is Sonic. Basically, whenever I go see a movie... With, ju really. with just Barbara. With just Barbara. Without our parents. If dad's coming, then I don't typically do this series, but... Because Lily don't come. Right. Well, so anyway, the point is, this is the, uh, this is the, uh, th this is the series where I talk about a movie. Barbara, do you want to take this? Because you're the Minions fan. I get to talk? Yeah, you about the movie? Well, I'm, what am I going to say? I didn't like it. I thought it was mostly just bad. So, you talk while I drive. Okay. About minions. And make sure that the footage is good because I'm not going to edit this video. <laughs> well, they're going to get me burping in there then because I, I just had a massive one. I don't care. Okay, so, um, minions is basically minions like. Right. Oh, yeah, minions spoilers in this video. If oh, you yeah. care about the freaking rise of First of all, wow. this thing? Gas. Don't it's advertise a gas. beverage on my. Sorry. I, well, I mean, I oh, can say hey, it's good. I need gas. Okay, let's get gas. Do you have gas money? Uh, no, I don't. That's fine. I can. You can pay and then tell mom, hey, I paid for the ghost. No, I can make it home. Okay. Can you make it back to town? I can make it to Brideville. Brideville's farther than here. It's just cheaper. I can make it back tomorrow. I can make it back tomorrow. Okay. Okay, whatever you say. Anyways. Um, Minions was like probably the best thing I've ever experienced in my life. I laughed so hard. Oh my gosh. I love the Minions. I don't think I don't think anyone understands how much I love the Minions. Because like, oh my gosh, I love the Minions. Despicable Me and the Minions movies are top tier. Top tier. Let me tell you. Minions is like, oh my gosh. So now that you said so, about you love the Minions, how about you talk about the actual movie? Oh, the <laughs> Okay. Give me like, give me like. Top, I'm top okay. Three inside of my chat, inside of my heart, I am a five-year-old little boy. Okay, so. Because you laugh at all the butt and. Yeah, they showed. Fart they and showed. There are no poop. There's a million. They showed a lot of butts and farts the in the fart, movie, the and fart it was choir, so funny. The fart, the fart choir was absolutely. Oh, I'm not even in the frame. It was absolutely yeah, amazing. Please be in the frame. Oh my gosh, it just my arm is tired from going like this. But. Oh, Oh my gosh, I was just wiping the spit off the corner of my mouth. Sorry. I'm a really gross person, so. Um, Alright, no train. Okay. Um, oh my goodness. I okay, can't even top focus. 10 jokes. Top, focus. 10, top jokes. 10 jokes. Oh my gosh. I loved um, when I liked the, when the, the lady was doing the acupuncture and she used the acupuncture sticks to move the guy and he was like punching really? them. I actually hated that scene. I thought more that was than cool. Um, I also liked the. I really liked the torture mechanism where he was just spinning, and then they they pan they came back to it later when the minions found them when uh, Steve, when Stuart, uh, Kevin, and Bob found them, and he was just they showed him in the window and he was just so dead spinning just in a slow circle. Oh my gosh, so funny. This is like top tier funny. Okay, let me tell you. Oh my goodness, I love this movie. <laughs> okay, number three. Number three. Um. Let me think. Once you ask me the jokes, I totally forget all of them. Okay, great. Well, what's your third favorite show? I laughed a lot during the beginning. I laughed at the joke that, um, where um, Gru said, Gru was like, where did you guys get all this denim? I laughed at that. I laughed at a lot of the movie. Mainly just the minions, like, just being stupid. Number four. Minions! Um, number four. Number four. Whoa. What? what am I the Burger at? King sign is torn down. Yeah, it's been down since that really? big windstorm, like, months ago. Huh. I don't ever go to Burger King. Um, number four. I can't think of it. I liked the... It's still there. Yeah. I liked the, um, I liked the, um... The Scarlet Overkill lunchbox, and then the Steels <laughs> dragged him underwater. Okay, number f was that four? That's so it's four. number five. Number five. Oh my goodness. I um, I loved Otto. Oh my gosh. Are no, you just, serious? I hated just... Otto. <laughs> I leaned over to you like four times and said, "Man, I hate Otto." I know. I heard you every time. Oh my gosh. But I loved the, that the 
Otto and the guy riding the motorcycle, the uncle, became like best friends like on that cool ride. Uncle. That's oh, um, the cool uncle. The cool uncle was just fine. One thing that like totally like threw me off guard was when they totally beat up that kid. Like they, like he was on his pogo stick, and the and Stuart threw the oh, skateboard yeah, underneath they, the pogo yeah, stick, yeah, yeah, and he yeah. was like fell so he fell so hard, or like he sprung up and he got his hair chopped off by the ceiling fan. Oh, I liked um, <laughs> I liked um the one, the when um uh what wild wild knuckles was beating up the guy and um he was like showing them techniques or whatever and he beat up the guy the bodyguard guy and he ripped his hair off and then he blew the hair and it like beat them up. So that's, that's, <laughs> that's uh, six now. No, that no, that was yeah, that was like three jokes you just said. Oh, was it? Yeah. So seven. I think you're a seven. I think this is gonna be no. I think you're on number eight now. So say number eight, if I counted right, because you did the one you said auto, that yeah. counts. Uh huh. You said. Um, I mean, all the butt jokes are funny, but we're not gonna count them because they're obviously count. funny. You said auto. You said uh, I'm gonna turn here because I, this guy just put in front of me and he's gonna be. Sick. You don't know that. He just you can't go fast after you just pull out of a turn. Okay, whatever. Um what else? What else? Yeah, whatever. So number eight, what's your eighth favorite joke? I can't believe I saw that movie. Oh, uh, my eighth favorite joke is that I made Isaac see the movie and he bought Imagine Party Baby. That is probably the funniest joke. Is that <laughs> I went to see the movie in the first place. Um movies. Number nine. I'm counting that. You're counting that? Oh okay. Oh I was yeah, joking. for sure. Number nine. Including the Imagine Party Babies? Uh, well, we'll Which talk about, surprise. about that in a minute. Um, number nine. Oh. I loved um, when they were training for Kung Fu and how Stuart was dancing and then they all danced and then she beat up Stuart and Kevin but she left Bob untouched. I liked, I liked 0% of that scene <laughs> except for the parts where they beat up Minions. Because, uh. you see, I don't like the Minions. I'll give you number 10 right now. It's when that Minion was on fire. <gasps> oh my gosh, I forgot about that. And in the background, there was this minion in like a little was concrete little thing. Oh my gosh, the minion was so hot. He was on fire. He was like all like black and burnt, like pitch black. And he, his skin was like flaking off kind of. I don't know. It was, like, it was like a burnt log. Imagine a burnt log. And then there was a little bit of like fire on his head. And he was just smiling and happy. And then behind them, there was a minion that was like covered in green goo. <laughs> and then there was a minion behind him that was like all in a cement thing. It was just spinning really fast. It was so funny. Okay, I'm gonna tell you the funnest. Oh, hold on. Also, another joke. I loved how Kevin hated Otto. I thought that was so funny. Relatable, yeah. It was so funny. Okay, anyways. Uh, I'm gonna tell you the fun, the thing that happened before we saw the movie. Um, we went to Dollar General first for no reason. Um, not, not illegal. Uh, not, not smuggling outside food. It's not illegal to do that. It's not illegal, but it's frowned upon. Anyway. Oh, it's not. Everyone holy does crap! It. You can play this with the balance board. Okay. We don't anyway. have that anymore, though. Well, I can arrange. So, uh, our local Dollar General has had, they have got a section for, like, old Wii and DS games. And most of them are pretty bad. But on the shelf, uh, I've always seen one called Imagine Party Babies. That's babies with a Z, by the way. So, <laughs> whoa. Uh, so, <laughs> for a long time I've been joking about buying it. Just, you know, it's imaginable. How funny would it be to say I own Imagine Party Babies? So I figured in the spirit of I'm genuinely watching the Minions movie, I bought Imagine Party Babies. Is that in the frame? Oh, can we show the QR code thing? I don't know. The barcode? Yeah. Yeah, probably. Okay. Anyway, uh, so I bought Imagine Party Babies, but here's the thing oh, that happened. I take the babies up to the It's front. backwards, but you get the gist. Whatever. I take the babies up to the front desk. <laughs> no, you don't. They no, give it to I don't. You. So the Wii games are like behind the desk. So I walk up to the front desk, and I'm already laughing because this is an absurd thing to ask a person. Yeah. I said, hey, <laughs> you've got some Wii games back there. Can I look at the one called Imagine Party Babies? And even the cashier didn't know that that exists. He's like... I've never heard of that what? in my life. So he picks it up, and it was $5. And so I was like, sure, I'll buy it. And he rings it up, and he says... He's got this confused look on his face, and he's like, uh, okay, so this is weird, but I'm gonna need to see your ID for this. What? It's ready to eat for everyone. It's babies. E for everyone. So, a ba Comic I, mischief is why. I'm not 18, right? So, like, I guess I can't buy Imagine Party Babies. 
And so he calls up his manager. Well, first the other yeah, guy. Yeah, there was an old man there who was, was offering like, to buy it like, for I'll, me, I'll, but he I'll that's do it. not allowed. And then apparently that's not allowed. No, it's, it makes sense that it's not allowed. It is, but, anyway. but it's a game. It's not like we're buying it's drugs. It's rated E for everyone. There's pictures of babies on it. It's because the babies are naked. Yeah. No, it's E for everyone. So anyway. They're naked. Apparently, I needed to be 18 for that. So he called up the manager, and the manager said, that's stupid. Just override it. Just let him buy the thing. So I bought a Magic I Party Babies. Was. I bought a Magic Party Babies. It's $5 I will be, for this glorious thing. I will be playing it on stream eventually. I've got a stream idea. Oh, my gosh. I've got a stream we're going to do this week at some point, And then after that, a Magic Party Babies. So. This is so fake. This baby's holding a cake. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna look at it. I, I was talking. No, I thought you were trying to show it to me. Like, I was showing to the right. camera. I was also talking to you though. Um, this baby's holding the cake, and it's so big. Look at it. It's dripping all over him. It reminds me of one of those games, like the baby hazel game. You know what I mean? Oh, Lily, don't know. Anyway, uh, what a day it's been, right? I watched. We got off of work, and we yeah, went. Yeah, we went to subway. Straight. We went straight to the theater from work. No, we went to Subway. Well, we ate lunch at Subway. But other than that, we went straight from the theater to work. Oh, yeah. Or from work to the theater, I mean. We both got off at the same time, and the movie started an hour later. Oh, yeah, baby. So I'm already, baby. Oh, I'm going to drop this phone. Anyway. Uh, oh, yeah, we work now. I didn't, like... I guess I didn't... Well, they don't need to do I'm just saying. Life update. Uh... Yeah, life update. I've been doing this for, like, a month. Um, I've been doing it for like three days, so you know what? Yeah, anyway. Life update for me. So, <laughs> let's get back on the track about minions. minions I, I brought up Imagine thing. Party Baby so that maybe I didn't have to think about it. my eyes are fun. I, uh, I thought the movie was. It's just like, like Respectfully movies. bad. I thought it was really bad. Now, I am a minion hater. I think the first Minions movie is awful. We watched it in Spanish the other day because it's free it on in, Peacock. We watched it in Spanish the other day because in preparation uh, and we watched it in Spanish because I really don't care about the Minions enough to watch he it refused, in language. He refused. He refused to watch it. Yeah, I don't want to know what they're saying. Here's the thing about the Minions movies. There's this phenomenon that happens every time I watch the Minions movies where the Minions will speak gibberish for so long that it begins to sound normal to my ears and then a human character will speak English and I have to, like, my brain has to readapt to hearing English. And it's awful. I also hate that the Minions speak Spanish sometimes. Like, there's words of Spanish in there. But there's also words of English. But there's also words and of English And I don't sometimes. know Spanish, so I don't know if they're speaking Spanish all the time. I'm just, no, they're not speaking. But I know enough Spanish to, like, sometimes they'll say a word. And I'm like, that was Spanish. But usually it's gibber. Why are they speaking any of Spanish? Anyway, so... <laughs> Uh, there was one. There was a couple scenes that got a laugh out of me. Only like two. <laughs> There's only two laughs that got out of me. One was the name Nunchuck. Oh, any scene with Nunchuck in it was absolutely amazing. I didn't think Nunchuck was that funny. Uh, when she uh, when she would like <gasps> float away. The pet was. rock scene. <laughs> pet rock scene had Barbara rolling on the theater floor, crying, <laughs> screaming, laughing. Oh, and the pilot scene. Oh my gosh, yeah, they dressed the up as pirates, near, pilots and almost killed everyone on that the plane. Minions very nearly uh, did a bad thing in an airplane. Bob being the, the stewardess, just like, they should have Stuart being the stewardess. Because Stuart is. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I get yeah. you, I get you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, anyway, that would be too smart for the Minions writers. Anyway, uh, what was I even saying? Oh yeah, Nun, Nunchuck, just the name is funny, I think. And then also, uh, the scene with Otto on the trike, on the tricycle, where he's, like, zooming through, like, the whole world. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was decent. Oh, that was I super got, funny. Got laugh on. Oh, other than that, pretty stone face. Um, sometimes I would laugh at the sheer absurdity, or, or I would laugh at, me laughing. at how hard Barbara was laughing. Because <laughs> it wasn't, like, a chuckle. It was, like, she was, like, belly laugh, guffawing at this movie. <laughs> Just like oh. she thought it was the funniest thing ever, ever made. So oh, I'm looking at pictures of it on, right now on Are Google, on so that I can no on Google, on Google, so they can remember the scenes and then talk about them. Uh, well, they're not gonna have pictures because it, it just came out today. No, they've actually a lot. What? Yeah. Oh, opening day. We saw minions. So. This is an opening day. This is the day before opening day. This, that's opening day. What is it? Yeah. Opening night. Um, 
Um, the scene where I know this was in the trailer, but the scene where Bob and where Bob Kevin and, and Kevin Stewart. And and no. Not that scene. That where was they? The where they um slept with Groot? That was in the trailer. Yeah. I avoided the trailer. I watched the trailer. I only saw the trailer when it came on before another. Uh, what movie was I watching that Rise of Gru? Stop, came stop, on? stop, stop, stop. Was it Sonic? Minions, The Rise of Gru, Stackable Buddies Blanket. Okay, well, we don't need to buy it. Um, did I tell you guys uh, that Garber very nearly spent $40 on a blanket the other day? I did spend $40 on a blanket, and then I returned it, because I realized it, because realized you, it was absurd. Because you left the store, and you were like, did I just spend $40 for a small blanket? And we were like, yeah, you did. Anyway. Mad Barbara, skills. Barbara. What? Look at the frame right now. Oh, sorry. This is content, Barbara. Content. Well, I've been looking. Look at this. Oh, Barbara. <laughs> Now I'm going to have to censor that. Oh, yeah. Don't show that. <laughs> I can't see what it means in that. Oh, my gosh. This is amazing. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I love minions. I hate minions. But at least the movie was short. <laughs> At least it's still it's still light out. This is the first time in this series that it's still light out. I'm a little bit mad we didn't do this series for Morbius. I I saw Morbius, you didn't. I didn't see Morbius because I was too busy. But I'm a little mad that I didn't go see Morbius with you so that we could do this, but Well you could have gone the night that me and Dad went, you just didn't want to. No, I was busy that night. I was doing homework. It was like finals week that I came out. Okay, I went through all of the Minions pictures, so... Were you showing the Minions pictures that whole time? Not the whole time. Oh. Only two pictures. Only two, okay. Yeah. I don't know when's the next time we're going to do this. Probably not with Thor. Yeah. We don't go to the theater often because our local theater only has a few movies only at a time. Only has three movies at a time. Uh, so. We don't watch freaking... No, I almost joked about watching Jurassic World, but I don't want to see that. I do. I, I love Jurassic Park. I don't like Jurassic World. I just like that the... last Jurassic World movie was a little bit. I cried. Garbage. It was totally. You cried while I was laughing at the same scene. <sighs> the Bronchiosaurus died. I thought it was bad. That movie. Yeah. The, the the Jurassic World what was it Dominion or is that the new one? Whatever the last one was called. Dominion is the new one. What was the last one called? I don't remember. I hated it. So. The beginning of the Minions movie? Okay, they knocked out the letters in Illumination, so it just said Minion. They do that in every movie. No, they don't. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Yes, they do. Not the way they did it this time. No, it just, they knock out the letters, so it just says Minion. They do that in every movie. No, but they, like, sometimes they turn, like, the lights off in the letters. Well, yeah, it's a different animation every yeah, time. Yeah, but this one was creative, joke. and they squished a Minion. didn't let me finish. They squished a Minion in between the Minions. I liked when the minion was on okay. fire because I like pain inflicted upon those little balls. It was happy. Okay. Oh, when Bob got crushed by all those things, when they hit Bob with a bunch of stuff and they dropped a safe on Bob and then they opened the safe and Bob had like gone through the safe. Oh, that was great. I hope none of you wanted to watch Minions because it's spoiled for you. Also, I hope none of you wanted to watch Minions because you don't deserve that. Oh, Minions is so good. Watch it. I don't care if I spoiled it all for you. Watch it. It's an this, adventure and it's a good one. This opinion that. belongs to an individual and is not representative of the views of Isaac's video now. Yeah. <laughs> but it's it's supported by me. Not me. Not the channel. We do not endorse minions. I do. I don't you don't speak for me. I speak for the channel. Do you speak for the trees? Are you the Laura? Yeah, I'm the Laura. You know what the trees are saying right now? Watch Minions. Minions is bad. That's what the trees saying. just talk to me. I'm, They're outside. I'm the one who speaks to the trees. We just established that I speak to the trees. You speak to the trees. The trees speak to me. No, they speak to me too. I speak for the trees. No, you speak to the trees. No, I counsel with the trees and then I uh, negotiate. Whatever, on Isaac. Whatever. Whatever. They don't speak. You can't the change tongue. it just because it's convenient. They don't speak the modern tongue. Whatever. What if I speak tree? You don't. I speak oak. Speak tree right now. That's no. <laughs> that's offensive. That's 
highly offensive. <laughs> to trees? Yes. Okay. Well, this has gone off minions, so I think we should probably end the video. We're not gonna end the video yet. What? Um, traditionally, the video lasts until we're home, so we've got a few minutes left. Oh yeah, um, we have like two minutes left. Sorry. Not two. We got probably a few. Anyway, uh, you know what? I'll do a channel announcement real quick. We finally, finally, finally shot about 50% of the next episode of Isaac's Art. What are you doing? Are you making noise during my important announcement? <laughs> Sorry. You weren't doing it the entire video. We finally shot the first half of the next episode of Isaac's Odyssey. Hopefully that's out next week. It could not. It could be a while yet. Originally this show was supposed to last the summer and that's it. Uh, now it is... Well, that was before you knew that mom was going to make you get a job. No, it wasn't. I was, I was planning on getting a job since like the beginning of the school year. Really? Yeah. Um, I was never planning on getting a I job. I was planning on getting a job this summer, like always. So anyway, it was before I knew that it would be like record highs so early in the summer. I thought it was going to be a little less hot than that. Uh, we were supposed to film the second half today, but I had to go into work on short notice and then we watched Minions. Anyway, you don't need to know about that. So, uh, we'll film the next half of the episode sometime in the coming week. It's supposed to rain tomorrow so we can't do it then but uh uh yeah so keep your eye out those uh those uh, episodes are going to come out sporadically i don't have any schedule i don't know how long the show is going to be on the channel it could be all year it's only going to be 10 episodes i think is what i have planned but it's going to be you'll start seeing why it's going to take so long it's going to start making sense so bear with me on that it's going to be a good show, I promise you. Uh, we'll be streaming at some point this week. I have some materials that I borrowed from the library that we're going to stream with. So, at the very least, I have to return those on Wednesday. So, at the latest, we will be streaming on Tuesday. We've got time on Saturday. I work in the morning on Saturday, so we can totally do it then. I work in the afternoon from 1 to 3. Well, we can do it in the evening. Tomorrow evening we can't do it. Maybe tomorrow afternoon, depending on what the girls end up doing. Anyway, I'm I'm getting ahead of myself. We'll stream eventually. I know we haven't done anything on this channel for a while, but I've been wicked busy and wicked tired, and I've been actively trying behind the scenes. I've got a whole bunch of stuff prepared and ready to come out soon. I've got video ideas that are gonna, you know, have actual production quality. Where did you put? Oh, you're holding it up there. Okay. Uh, so. Uh, keep so an I eye turned out. it off and just like went Yeah, yeah, you, I was talking to myself that whole time, talking. right? <laughs> keep an eye out. We'll be playing Imagine Party Babies at some point. We'll be playing some other stuff at some point. I'll be making real videos again uh, here shortly. The lighting is bad. Yeah, no kidding. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm okay, though. That's it. I don't know when Isaac's Odyssey is going to out. But soon. We're almost home, guys. So, yeah. Uh, um, final one thoughts more on Minions. Thing on Minions. Do you want to give them... Literally, I paid for... I... I paid for my ticket. I paid for my ticket. And the food and my dinner so I could watch Minions, guys. And I don't have any money. I know that I said I got a job, but I literally got the job three days ago and I don't get paid until next week. So I don't have any money. Okay. Uh, Barbara, Barbara, you want to finish up with uh, just two sentences on Minions? Minions is the best thing ever and you Minions, should go watch it. Gru. Minions, the rise of Gru is amazing. Minions 1 is amazing. So I will say, I think... And well, go watch Despicable Me if you can. All three of them. Go watch them if you can. Also, when they had the little nudge, the little the little cameos of Victor, I'm mean, Victor, Vector. not Victor, and uh, the other doctor guys. Nefario. Nefario, yeah. I liked whenever they talked about the moon. Oh, yeah. I forgot about okay. that. Um, I said two sentences. We are home. I said two sentences. Go watch Minions, please and thank you. Do not watch Minions, The Rise of Gru. Do it. Don't rot, don't do it. You should have seen the look on the guy's face when I... I walked up and I was so ashamed of myself. I said, mm. I can't believe I'm doing this. But two for Minions. And I was like, yeah, Minions! And the guy was like, yeah, I would say the same Isaac thing. also didn't pay for his ticket. I paid for it. He has to pay me back. Well, so don't yeah, listen to his I, lies. You told me to use your card. Anyway. Anyways, go watch Minions, please. Go watch Minions, please.